hi everyone in this video let's see how we can read an excel file as input and print it to console and write into a file here uh, I have created an input file this is my input file it has two tabs two sheets in it one is sales order and another one is received and my excel sheet has seven columns order date region rep item units unit cost and total and here order date is date and other three fields are strings and we have a integer and numeric type double or big decimal some decimal values <coughs> let's see how we can read this file in talent let's create a job let's name it as read excel file To read Excel file, you have to use T, T file input Excel component. So here uh, we are we have to select this option because we are reading uh, Excel 2000 file format. So and let's browse the location where our file is. So my file is at this location, Documents, Talent, Input sales data and my doc <coughs> my excel has two sheets i want to read only one sheet from it is that is sales order so i have to give the same name so let me copy this sales order and put it here so So it will read only sales order sheet from the spreadsheet. Here I have header so I will put one and I don't have any footer and the first column uh, that starts at column number one and the last column we don't need to mention if you want to re read until a particular column then you have to mention the last column suppose if you have 10 columns but you want to read only uh, 5 columns you should give the last column uh, number here and the schema I have 7 columns so I am going to uh, fill this order date region these are the columns I have in the sheet so order date is in the date format and region rep item these are string formats here and the units is integer and unit cost and total are some decimal values units is integer and let me put uh, double for these two so this is my schema so we have given all the required values here in the settings we have given the file name the path of the file and the sheet which we want to read from and the header and the schema <coughs> first I want to print uh, data from Excel to our uh, console so for that I am going to use T logro component 
let me connect uh, excel component to tlagro here we can print uh, in tlagro we can print uh, the data in different formats let me use table to see data in well well formatted manner let me run the job I got this error because I open this excel file here so let me close this okay let me rerun the job <laughs> the job uh, did read 43 uh, records from this excel sheet let's look at the data here we have data with seven columns so let's see how we can uh, read the content of one sheet to a CSV file for that I have to use T file T file output delimited component And let's connect this T row one, uh, sorry, row one to T file output delimited. Let me delete this T log row here. So I want to include header. So if you click on edit schema, the schema from T input component is propagated to output component. So we don't need to create schema again for for the output component so let's give a uh, comma as separator here and I want to store this file uh, somewhere somewhere so I'm going to give some location here I'm going to use talent output sales data dot CSV so I'm going to uh, store my output into this location as sales data dot CSV file and I'm going to include the header and the field separator for this file would be comma. So let me run the job and see uh, whether it will create an output file or not. Yeah, it did read uh, 43 records and store into this output file. Let's look at the output file here, output. And if we look at the timestamp, uh, 108 p.m. So this is our file. Let's open this notepad. So it has created a CSV file with uh, all the columns all the seven columns here this is how uh, we read excel and write into a csv file thank you for watching